practice fields in Stillwater anyway should be pretty dry. Uh, we'll find out. Yeah, Pat Jones enters his 11th year as head coach of the OSU Cowboys. He's the all-time winningest coach in OSU history, but has struggled since 1988. And joining us live from Stillwater is Pat Jones. Coach, your team takes the field in a few minutes. It has to be a very tired bunch. Well, I would think so, Dean. I hope so anyway. We've been in pads since uh, last Saturday, and uh, we, we banged away pretty good this morning, so I, I hope they are a little bit tired. Your offense has struggled the last couple of years. Mike Gundy is the new offensive coordinator. Are you hoping that the uh, all-time record setter in the Big 8 Conference can pass some of that along? Well, it's much easier to pass along to guys like Thurman Thomas and, <laughs> and uh, Harley Dykes and that crew we had before. I, oh, I would like to think we, we'll make some improvement, Dana, but again, it's, it's, it's nothing magical there to it. And, uh, we're getting a little bit better for our skilled guys. If we can get some big play people uh, going, it'll certainly help that. Biggest surprise so far of camp? Well, I don't know. I mean, Andre Richardson, the, the freshman tailback, Dean, is, is going to be a good player because we kind of thought that coming in. Uh, we're kind of curious about him until we actually got him here, but he has got some big playability from scrimmage or catching the ball, or perhaps as a kick returner. All right, Pat, thanks, and we'll talk to you live at practice with the Cowboys at 6 o'clock, and we'll also have the latest on the OU Sooners at that time. In Austin, Barry Switzer had tough duty this morning, told me it was difficult to bring in eight players and tell them they were cut and no longer Dallas Cowboys, and one of them was kicker Richie Cunningham, who did not have a happy day, missed this one and was 0 for 3 in preseason. Cowboy cuts, Cunningham, receiver Tim Daniel, James Parrish, Greg Shorp, Alfie Birch, Keith Wagner, running back Mark Mason, and Gabriel Olipido. I worked on this name all, all day, and I just still can't get it right. Anyway, he's gone. First mandatory cut is next Tuesday, and the teams must be down to 60 by then. We saw it. Thank you, Dean. Okay, <laughs> You're welcome. We'll be right back.